Hey guys, uh, this is Borzak3 here. Today I wanted to show you a little alarm system that I have. I came up with this on my own, actually. Um, so I wanted to show it to you guys, and maybe I'll do a tutorial in the future if you guys like it, but uh, here it is. Oh, look, I have cool stuff. Wait, what is this? No! You can't get out. Uh, anyway, so what we have is a nice little alarm system. That pressure plate activates about five different things, I, th I would like to say. Um, iron. Okay, so in case you didn't see that earlier, my dog spawned into here too. Um, that's another one of the things that activates. Anyway, so, pressure plate placed right here, activates so many different things, and I am just going to run you through what those things are. So, when you first step on the pressure plate, the signal is carried out under here, comes right into this T flip-flop. Uh, this T flip flop was a design from uh, CMB Minecraft. Uh, he has done so many awesome Minecraft videos, and you guys should really check him out if you haven't already. But it toggles this on, and this redstone, as you can see, splits into like five different things. Um, first, it goes over here and pushes my dog into the water. Um, like my dog comes over here. Let's see. Dog here. Come. Um, dog comes over here. He's sitting in like one of these four spots. Okay. And then when the when the redstone activates, it pushes the pistons. Come on, doggy. Whoa. Teleport to me. Anyway, so the dog comes into here and he sits. So right there, okay, that's where he is. His pushes, pistons push him into the water, and when a dog is in the water, they automatically stand up, and when they stand up, they teleport to you. Um, and then once he teleports to you, he automatically sits back down. So you can be walking like anywhere, and your dog will teleport to you, and you'll be like, oh, someone's in my private you know, stash. Um, anyway, second thing this does, is it goes straight through here and starts the lights flashing. Now as you can see I have a little clock here um, with three pulses. So the signal comes through here and if you know anything about redstone you would know that a repeater going straight into a block powers the powers that block and it also power anything next to it. It's a good thing that I don't have a problem this. Oh, that's kind of cool. I don't need these two. Or three, actually. Should still work. Anyway, um, probably should be editing this with you guys right here. But anyway, the signal comes through and powers this inverter, which is basically what makes the lights start flashing. And the signal also comes through Can I here. Watch? No! God damn it! thing also comes through here and powers this block when this piston is activated and it sets the alarm off. Um, and then the last thing that this does is it blocks off the door if you didn't notice that. Uh, this redstone gets powered right into this block, gets inverted twice, and then so that toggles this signal on, powers this piston and it powers this piston over here, right there which blocks off the door. So that punches. The dog is teleported to me. Lights are flashing. Ah, I do need that. Okay. So, good to know. Always experiment, right? And then it sets the alarm. So, that is that. If you guys liked, please make sure to let me know because I will gladly put a tutorial up on here. Um, 
So, yeah, that is it. Please like, comment, subscribe, etc., etc. Uh, and thanks for watching.